Hey, this is how I make nail art last for two weeks. The first thing I do is avoid water because when immersed in water your nails expand and when you take them out they contract. So this can cause chipping or cracking if you polish them too soon. I'd wait 30 minutes after washing your hands or a couple hours after you just took a long shower. So if you go to a salon that's still doing water manicures, you might want to rethink that. The second thing you want to do is clean your nails. After pushing back your cuticles, you want to remove the excess oil because this can interfere with how the polish adheres. I wet my nails with a acetone soaked cotton ball and clean the sidewalls, cuticle and tip area with an acetone dipped cotton swab. So without a strong foundation, anything will collapse or break down. Polish just lasts longer when you put it on top of an overlay. You can try the CND smoothing gel. It's a UV cured smoothing base and it's great for natural looking nails and it's easily removable. Or you can get a clear gel polish applied and just polish your nails on top of it and it will surely last longer. Or if you like acrylics and gels, I would try the new Brisa Light Sculpting Gel so you could add length to your nails but it still soaks off. Or if you don't have time for that and you're not a professional, I'd say just use a regular base coat like I am now. I'm just going to use Essie's First Base Base Coat and apply that all over my nail and seal the tip. And then I'm just going to polish my nails. You're going to do your first coat, make sure you seal the tip, and then wait for it to dry completely. And then I'm going to do my second coat and seal the tip. And I'm just going to show you this again with another color so I can prepare a nail for a different design later on. Then I'm going to add some nail art. Here I'm going to do some studs. If you're doing any rhinestones or studs, you want to make sure they're going to lay flat on your nail. So here I'm bending my studs so that they're curved a little bit and they fit that natural curve of your nail. This will prevent them from lifting up at all. And I'm just going to put a little bit of top coat on and then stick my stud into the top coat and press it down. I'm just going to apply them all over my nail so you can see how they last. Or you could just leave your nails plain or you could do a simple design. Here I'm just going to do a quick design with white acrylic paint. And I do love acrylic paint because it is so easily fixable. If you mess up, you could just use some water and a cuticle stick to remove any mess ups. And whether you're doing simple nail art or studs and rhinestones, always apply a layer of top coat. Here I'm using such a V and for this nail you want to make sure that you seal all the edges of the studs and the polish in between them so make sure you have enough polish on your brush and always seal the edge and then I'm just going to do a quick coat on top of my simple nail art and seal the edges. Okay, so my real secret is that I'm using IBD's UV top coat on top of the Sech AV that I just applied and I just apply a very thin layer of it. It's the only UV top coat I know of that is made to apply over regular nail polish. No other UV top coat is going to be good for that. It'll like crack your polish. And now I'm a professional. I'm not encouraging everyone to go out and buy this on a UV lamp if you're not. But if you do go find this, handle it correctly. Or you can go to your nearest salon and see if they offer this and just get it applied on top of nail art that you have done already. And then I just cure this for two minutes in a UV lamp. And then once it is cured, it's completely dry. You can touch it, you won't mess it up. But even without this top coat, it should last about a week. And I just wanted to show you 12 days later, this is what my nails look like. There was minor chipping on the simple nail art nails and the studs stayed on perfectly. There is a little bit of discoloration. And I just wanted to show you how easy it is to remove that top coat. It's nothing different than regular nail polish. You don't have to soak your nails, it comes right off. So that is how I make my nail art last for two weeks. I hope you enjoyed and subscribe.